right what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back your boy is at work and for all you guys that are out there asking for the other series don't worry about it your boy is back in the driving seat and i'm ready to go things come up in real life you gotta shut shit down sometimes um you guys know the issues well not really issues but the situation that i'm dealing with at home so every now and then things are going to slow down on the channel for some things and i will keep you guys updated for the most part um so i do need to get out some stuff for early access but at the same time i did tell you guys that i'm kind of trying to run through the stuff that are going on on the channel right now example full metal alchemist and the other one jojo's i'm trying to get through these series because not to say that i'm going to ignore early access okay because i don't want you guys that are out there that are you know paying your two dollars per month for early access right i don't want you guys to think that i'm ignoring early access so you unsubscribe to early access and just wait in the fact of the matter is i just can't do early access consistently because i have these to do too so what i'm trying to do is do my best to get through as um you know i've already wrapped up a couple of what was going on on the channel so it's soon the only thing that's going to be continuously running on the channel is going to be um sons of anarchy and um let's name it this again <laughs> jojo's bizarre adventure i think that's the only things that are going to be everything else is going to be on early access so with me finishing full metal alchemist which i'm trying to get done as quickly as possible as soon as i'm done reacting with that it's going to free up another slot for me to start doing something else so when everything is on early access the channel can run on just early access and then things just come out on youtube and it just come out on youtube when it when it you know, out on youtube you know what i'm saying so that's what i'm trying to do so just be patient guys and we will get there okay so i know that people who watch this series on the channel are wondering where's slam dunk why can't we get monster consistently uh uh this is the reason okay so just wanted you guys to know that also i wanted to remind you guys to so please keep watching the intros please keep watching the reviews on the channel keep up the watch time other than that you know other than that i do want you guys to keep watching these because you never know when i'm going to leave a clue in these reactions and then only the people who has been watching watching my intros and my reviews are going to know i'm giving you guys ample warning that is watching this don't pay no attention to the guys that don't watch my intros and reviews because they're going to miss out on the prize and they're going to be wondering, oh, you're doing giveaways? What do I need to do? Well, you didn't watch my intros and my reviews, so how the hell you going to know? Too bad. <laughs> That's the reason I'm giving you guys an incentive, and I'm telling you guys right now, keep watching, and don't be scrolling through it either. You better listen to what I have to say because I'm going to go back and I'm going to say, what did I say here or at this time or at this time slot or whatever the situation is, you know what I'm saying? And it's going to be a spur of the moment things. I'm, I have plans. I mean, I'm not telling you that that's what I'm going to do, but you know what I'm saying? I'm just giving you guys an example of what I could be referring to, you know, what I would do, but I'm pretty sure I'm not going to do that because that's in my opinion is kind of dumb that was just a quick example <laughs> it's kind of dumb because anybody could just go and <laughs> you know what i'm saying and just go look at the time stamp and tell me what i said so in any case let's get to the reaction i will see you guys for the review all right so that was episode 49 and 50 full metal alchemist man this series is so good bro like it's it's really good it's, i think it's only 14 episodes left if i'm not mistaken it's been a ride and we're closing in on the the end of the series i don't know how it's going to end you know so i just want to clarify some things that i said there um during the episode um you know i know a lot of people probably has edward you know what i'm saying top five alphonse top five 
but the author does a such a good job of constructing this story and having character development throughout the story that it's very hard for you to have them because in my in my opinion they are not playing that big of a part in the end game of the series like it started out about them and then it became about the homunculus and now it's it's basically fighting to save the world and everybody is involved so all these characters that you know we got used to you know in the first couple of episodes now we got Rossbach she was accused of murder they broke her out of prison blah blah blah, blah. she had to flee she went to Shing all that stuff um you know we got Havoc back in the mix again you know he was injured and stuff uh, so all these characters just come together to make this incredible mix and in my in my opinion I think just off of presence in the series if I should judge based on something else I mean at the end of the series I might have a different top five but right now in the series just based on presence when they're on screen and what they do and what you've known them for my top five just has it it just don't have Edward in it you know what I'm saying and I and he's just scraping the bottom you know what I'm saying of trying to get to the number five slot in in my opinion that's just me but anyways let's talk about what's going on I think father is about to pop off I think I think that I think pride is sending him a message like a Morse code message and I think he's hearing it and I think he's about to get up and go pop off in the city because he's like, are you trying to fool my plans? <laughs> you know, um, kind of stuff. So I'm, I'm waiting to see what he's going to do. Cause I know he's not going to go down just to go down. We still don't know what really happened to King Bradley. I still refuse to believe that he got blown up and that's, and that was it. Like, I think he's going to come back in some way, shape or fashion. If they do King Bradley like this in the show, I'm not going to be happy. They definitely gonna lose points if they just kill off King Bradley by some stupid ass explosion on a bridge or whatever. Like they definitely gonna lose points as a series for me if they just do that. I he has to come back before this series end. There's no way they kill Fuhrer Bradley like that. You know what I'm saying? So um, I'm definitely looking forward to seeing what they're going to do in the in that respect. Um, but man, General Armstrong, what more can I say about her? What, what more can I say about her? You know what I'm saying? Like, you know, I, I love being around strong women. I love being around strong women. That's how a strong woman should carry themselves. They know what they know and they tell you what they tell you. Now there's a difference between aggression and what general armstrong pursuit and a lot of people is going to be like oh that's an aggressive female you know what i'm saying you know this, this is aggressive female man <laughs> you know so a lot you're gonna have people that's going to say that and i know a lot of females that are like that but they just don't have a feminine side to them you can see that she's protruding this you know you know with lack of a better word a lot of manliness you know, with the stereotypical way of saying it, but at the same time, there's still a feminine side that you can see about her. You get what I'm saying? She has to be like that. She has to be like that. She's in the military. Like, I mean, other than the fact that, you know, you know, she is respected. And the reason why she's respected so much is because she those guys respect her because of how she trains them to be she follows the the the, the letter she do things by the letter you know what i'm saying she is not someone you can compromise very easily you know as you can see so she holds her values dear to her you know what i'm saying and you can't imagine how she feels that she has to even pretend to be on their side. And now she can let loose now that her men is in central. So I'm looking forward to seeing what they're going to do. Um, 
I don't know how this thing is is going to go down, but the thing of the thing that I like about Hohenheim is like he's such a humble dude. Dude is a super powerful alchemist, way talented than it, I think the only person that could probably go toe to toe with him is father. He's a ridiculously talented alchemist. This man don't have to do nothing to get to get shit done. He ain't got to clasp no hands. He ain't got to do none of that. This man had his hand in his pocket. And you see that big thing he created? You get what I'm saying? And that's the reason why Al asked him. is like, you're a, you know what I'm saying? You're a talented alchemist, right? You know what I'm saying? So that's crazy. But was awesome to see, you know? So I'm just looking forward to seeing what's going to happen next because now that we have all this stuff going on, Central is under attack. Um, I like the fact that Colonel Mustang's crew, they're not trying to injure anybody. I mean, they are injuring people, but they're not trying to kill anyone, right? And now we got the dudes from the Briggs in, the, in Central too attacking. So we'll see what's going to be the result of that. But I'm happy, man. I'm happy. This series is definitely fire. Of course i'm enjoying it and of course i know you guys are enjoying it too so anyways guys don't forget to leave a like on the video don't forget to comment on the video let me know what you think you guys have not been commenting lately on these videos i don't know why i get like one maybe two comments on on these videos my full metal alchemist videos like it'll it it's like a dream come true when i get 10 comments on the videos these days it's like people don't want to they don't have nothing to say they just want to watch the reactions and that's it and i know that most people are not going to watch the reactions i mean most people are not going to comment i get that but interaction with my videos help my videos to get recommended on youtube and i'm trying to tell you guys the more you guys like the more you guys comment is the better you know is the more likeliness for the algorithm to recommend my videos on other people's videos and stuff like that like that's just how it works but i the only thing i can do is i can take you to the water but i cannot force you to drink all i can say is i'm going to start you know surprising the people or doing stuff for the people who actually come back and like comment the videos and also um watch my intros and reviews um, I'm going to really start diving into really help those people out and you know what I'm saying? Do contests with them, give them a chance to win some money or a prize or something of the sort. I'm really planning. I'm have those things in the works right now. Um, so thank you guys once again for watching, man. I appreciate you guys for watching this video till the end. It really does help. Thank you guys, man. I appreciate y'all. I'm out. Peace.